I'm Matt and today we've got Harley Davidson's brand new Iron 1200. So, Iron 1200, just like an Iron 883 except bigger, but there you'd be wrong. As you can see we've got some mini 8 bars to play with here, along with the 1200cc Evolution engine. Now Harley says this makes about 36% more torque than the 883. It's just shy of 99 newton meters and honestly from riding it, it's bloody good fun. Also if you're looking at it and you're thinking, oh that tank looks a wee bit small, it's not actually the peanut tank that you're used to seeing on the 48. It's actually a 12 and a half litre job, so you can get a half decent range out of it. That being said, this is really a city bike, it's not really made out for touring. You've got uh, not too much travel in your uh, adjustable shocks out the back here and uh, your seat, it's nice and cushy and your riding position is really comfortable but this little Sons of Anarchy-esque screen up front doesn't really take much of the wind pressure off your chest. Out on the road, the Iron 1200 actually handles quite well. Being an iron model, it's got centrally mounted pegs so you've got quite a lot more of lean angle than you would say on the 48 and these big 8 bars, you actually have plenty of leverage on the front end of the bike. Uh, I am yet to touch down the pegs, but I'm sure of it being a Harley and my riding style being vaguely aggressive, um, that will happen at some point. Other stylistic features are the blacked out engine, blacked out shotgun exhaust and this beautiful cranberry paint. We're thoroughly enjoying our time with this bike and we also have up our sleeves the brand new 48 Special. Uh, so it'll be very interesting to compare these two bikes to get each other. But we're not going to tell you all about that now, so keep an eye out for it in an upcoming issue of Bike Rider Magazine.